very long corridor, that, isn't it? We were walking forever <laughs> to get together. Uh, hey, uh, welcome to uh, Friday's show and waiting in the bar to take us into the weekend, our old mucker, Rory Brenner. Hi, Rory. Who can turn himself into almost anyone, but can he do a werewolf? Well, that guy can. Actor Russell Tovey tells us about the new supernatural series, Being Human. Which looks really good. And uh, what's the reality after reality? What I mean is, what's life like after you've starred on a reality TV show? David Danday, Vanessa Phelps and Nicky Graham are here to bear witness. Okay, quickly to the bar then. Uh, Vanessa, David, you're watching this. What, what, what do you think? Do you think she's onto something? Well, I'm, I'm thinking wedding. Now, David, you're actually looking for love, aren't you? Do, are you looking for marriage again, though? Uh, maybe, yes. I'd, I'd go tomorrow. But uh, it's very expensive. They are right. I mean, going out to these swanky restaurants in town and maybe a swanky hotel afterwards and the bits and pieces are going into you're still at least 500 quid here so you know <laughs> she's you, added it up you, you want to no it's true I've been doing this recently <laughs> I've been to all these <laughs> West End restaurants as well <laughs> But no, Romford's a big spender. I, I, yeah, I'm not are, so yeah. sure that women like to keep a chap, you see. And it's the chaps that are losing their jobs in the, uh, in the city. So, uh, no, uh, more women are losing the jobs yeah. than men, aren't they? Uh, uh, yeah, a rate yeah. of four to one. Yeah. Again, yeah. which is why women want to... It was just, I was just trying to get out of it, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got a £500 wedding, and if you combine the wedding, then you can do the chicken, you can I'll buy... Do catering, you can do the cheap napkins. It sounds like you can get quite cheap napkins. Well, Plastic cutlery? <laughs> well, to stab each other with. <laughs> to, stop the, to stop the stabbings. No. So why didn't the marriage work, they wondered for a moment. <laughs> then we find out about the stabbings well, with the cutlery. I've got to say something. Um, we've actually broken bread at Vanessa's house and she talks about her chicken. You do a lovely banana. Thank you very much. Do you still indeed. do that? Do you still do that? Yes, yes. I'm very glad you said that in the public place. My banana <laughs> is the non pareil, certainly a class all on of its own. Um, right, okay, right. Uh, nobody knows. Ulrika Johnson's just one celebrity big brother, but will the whole experience change her life in any significant way? Well, joining us with their thoughts on that are Vanessa, Vanessa Feltz, who famously went a bit bonkers on the first ever celebrity <laughs> She's big brother. Bonkers. Say hello, Vanessa. <laughs> 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 David Van Day, who played by his own rules on I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here, and Nicky Graham, one of the most entertainingly eccentric contestants Big Brother has ever known. I have to have a look at you in the, in the diary room, because you were hysterical in the diary room. And, and, and the funniest thing that you said, I have to say, was that day you, when you were freezing, you remember, you went in, and you extended the word cold mm. probably to, for, for the longest possible length that it can be said without actually <laughs> taking a breath. And we'll see that as part of this little montage. I can't get my MP3 player to work! Who is she? Who is she? Who is she? Where did you find her? What do they think this is? Some kind of hotel? <laughs> is that where my tooth is going down and made a hole in my cheek? <gasps> and he's there. Oh, I'm drunk, but I need more alcohol. I'm so cold! I'm just letting you know that I'm not doing it. Good night. You were so... Well, how much of that yeah, was, was, was theatre? How much of that was theatre? And how much was that you just being you? It's... it's it, Vanessa can back me up here. It is very frustrating it, in there I, at I, times. I believe every word of it. It, yeah. it can be. Crazy. So that was you then? That really was you under pressure? Oh, God, yeah. yeah. And you can't get through to them. They just... They talk to you... It's almost like it's pre-recorded. As if you're mad. As if you're <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah. But you, you, you've appeared quite a lot in the papers after that. You were snapped at parties and things. You, you got on, you got invited to sort of, you know, openings and premieres and all the rest of it. How is it now? I mean, looking back, you, was it on the whole an experience that led you into a better place in your life? Or has it all died away now? And are you back where you were before you went in? Oh, God, it's the best thing I've ever done. Right. It's, I've been able to buy a flat, mm -hmm. two chihuahuas. I could take my family on nice holidays. Can you take me out? <laughs> <laughs> no. It's really interesting. So all three of you, basically, it's... I mean, you've been least affected by it, Vanessa, but yeah, you don't was, regret it. You, I certainly don't regret no, it. No, you, no. Your career's probably had the best boost. Yeah. And, and, and you have no regrets. In fact, it's, it's, it's made you wealthier, yeah. a little bit wiser. Yeah. Wiser. I've conquered demons. Pardon? It's just conquered <laughs> demons. <laughs> That's his job. <laughs>